In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how we can convert these core values slide, which looks very simple and very boring uh, to somewhat more modern and more innovative. All right. So let me just show you. So you can see here the core values. We have got responsibility, accountability, caring, sharing, excellence, innovation. And then I've converted this slide from this to this. You can see here how beautiful it is looking and how simple it is looking all right so i've just put some icons here with some different colors and i've reduced the text length and i've added some frame here or the border so you can see how we have converted this slide from very boring to very interesting slide please share like and subscribe my channel and the only channel on youtube for powerpoint where you can get 1000 plus free templates absolutely free and i have provided the link on the video description section of each video and you can support my channel through paypal or patreon so let's start the tutorial add a new slide go to insert shapes from the basic shapes select the oval shape just click it here go to the shape format and make the height and width as 1.3 and shape outline make it no outline and shape fill you can fill any color of your choice maybe i'm going to give this a uh, kind of a purple color and then i'm going to duplicate this by pressing ctrl d and here i'm going to reduce the size to 1.1 and shape outline make it white and shape fill make it no fill and put it exactly in the center all right then go to the insert click on the icons and choose the icon a relevant icon of your choice so for this i'm going to select a maybe an accountable or responsible i'm just clicking some uh, random icons here click insert and put it here and make the height and width as 0.7 and the graphic fill i'm going to fill this with white select all of these three uh, shapes go to the graphic format align center align middle all right so the next thing is i'm going to group this one so instead of just selecting all and group and i'm just going to select only the oval shapes grouping okay so for that select these two oval group oval shapes and press ctrl g to group it okay so remember that i have not grouped the icon here all right so once this is done go to the insert text box here i'm going to type my very first uh, core values let me just go again and as for example is responsible all right and then make the font size of your choice here i'm going to choose open sans uh, semi bold increase the size to maybe 22 and align it properly and i'm giving the same color what i've choose for the uh, this for the oval background all right so once this is done go to insert text box and insert a detailed text here i'm just going to give some dummy text and remove the unwanted text i don't want this much large text all right reduce the font size to maybe 14 and i'm going to give the color as a gray here and align it properly okay so now i'm just going to select this one and align it properly then hold the control shift key drag this down so i total i need a uh, six uh, core values so this is my second one again hold the control shift key bring it down and then select all hold the con <coughs> sorry hold the control shift key and drag it towards the right side all right then go to the insert text box here i'm going to type core values and center align increase the font size and i'm going to use open sans font extra bold and i'm going to give the gray color here and make sure that it is aligned in the center once this is done you just need to change this one for example here i'm just saying uh, accountable all right third is for example is caring fourth is 
sharing five is excellence and six is innovative or innovation <clears throat> all right so once this is done now it's time to select and give some different color fields here so you can see here i can just go and select and i can just give a different colors depending on the requirement okay just to give a good feeling that we are choosing some right colors for it okay so here i'm just giving some random colors so it's up to you to decide which color you need all right you can see here and this also i'm just going to give a maybe kind of a gray color all right and make sure that when you're choosing the text also i'm going to give the same color as we have given for this one which is the green color here you can see then the caring is the blue color all right and then this is somewhat dark blue and then this is a dark green and here this is the dark gray color all right so once this is done now it's time to change the icons to change the icons you just need to select the icon you can see here select like this go to the graphic format change graphic and say from icons now you can just choose any icon of your choice so some random icons i'm just going to choose here click insert so you can see here the icon got inserted here or replaced so now i'm going to change this one caring here caring i would like to use some kind of a wrist or a hand all right so i can just type hand here and i can just choose anything for example let me just choose uh, this one and click insert and you can see here is already inserted so likewise we can just go and give some different uh, icons for each options and once this is done you can just add a kind of uh, a border here for that go to insert shapes from the basic shapes i'm going to choose which is the frame draw a frame like this all right don't worry if it is uh, this much thick okay so i'm just going to reduce it narrow it down you can see the small orange point here just drag this outside shape outline make it no outline and shape fill i'm going to give the gray color here all right and reduce it till here select the core values and bring to front and fill this with white color so you can see here it's done so you can see how we have converted the slide which looks something like this to something like this.